Have you ever wondered about the billions of pounds of styrofoam that are thrown away every year? Yes, and the statistics are mind-blowing. Every year, almost 2 billion pounds of styrofoam are thrown away, and it fills up a staggering 25% of our landfills. And there just aren't any good existing solutions for used styrofoam. It is possible to use styrofoam in lightweight concrete, but their applications are limited. Others are working to convert styrofoam back into polystyrene pellets, but this process is difficult and expensive. After studying the chemical makeup of polystyrene, we calculated that it is over 92% carbon. And this sparked our idea. We figured that we could first densify and then convert polystyrene into activated carbon, and this can be used for filtering water. Since styrofoam was mostly air, we found that we could first heat it at 150 degrees C and compress it by over 95%. We then performed a series of experiments to carbonize the polystyrene at elevated temperature. After many failures and over 50 hours of testing, we successfully converted the styrofoam into carbon with over 75% efficiency. Finally, we evaluated several chemical reagents, including phosphoric acid and potassium hydroxide, to etch the carbon. Coupled with heating, we created activated carbon with surface areas of over 100 square meters per gram. That's the equivalent to the size of a volleyball court in just one gram of our activated carbon. In order to confirm the effectiveness of our activated carbon, we tested its ability to filter contaminated water samples. Similar to commercial grade activated carbon, our activated carbon successfully reduced the levels of many contaminants. We have consulted with a variety of engineers and university professors who have all confirmed that we developed an innovative solution to a global and environmental problem. We have therefore filed a provisional patent on our process. In summary, we took a very difficult problem and established a proof of concept on a laboratory scale. Styrofilter is just the beginning of an innovation to take dirty waste and make clean water.